This is a quick response to Thunderfoot's video, The Stagnation of YouTube. Hi there, Thunderfoot. I don't know why I'm saying hello to you. You never watch the bloody responses, clearly. Um, I understand where you're coming from in some ways. YouTube is, uh, is pretty much a stagnant pool, uh, at least uh, to a certain extent. Uh, but, you know, the biological metaphor runs out pretty fast. It runs out fast when you talk about it. When I talk about it, it's a stagnant pool, it runs out pretty fast. Because it isn't the biological organism, it's a corporate organism with an ecology, if that's the right word, uh, that's very carefully constructed to serve particular ends. There's no natural selection on YouTube, it's unnatural selection. And that unnatural selection is... Um, negotiated and arranged by the systems that YouTube and Google have put in place to do with how, how videos get featured, how uh, communities form, how they're maintained, what gets on the front page, how video responses work, you know this stuff, it's, it's, it's changed over time and it hasn't changed to service the needs of a fair playing field or to, to create a, an ecology in which the small plants can grow or the small plants can get and turn into a tangled bank of any kind, it's an ecology that's been managed particularly to serve the bottom line of uh, of Google and to fill its coffers, which is fine. You know, so the whole process is it's not about fostering small channels or allowing communities. It's about putting customers in front of advertisers. That's the bottom line. That's the system that's driving this thing forward. And that's not a biological system. That's a corporate system. I don't have any problem with that, but let's not confuse the metaphor. The, the, the place I come in, the problem I have with your video, quite honestly, Thunderfoot, and I've mentioned this before, so, you know, kind of coming back to all ground here, but uh, is that, yeah, YouTube is, is crap in lots of ways. It does this kind of fairly free system which allows us to put hours and hours of ourselves rambling on about different things online and occasionally get people to, to, to look at that stuff and engage with. Um, but it doesn't do much else. Anything else that takes place online is down to the users. You know, we don't have an awful lot of control, but we have a lot more control than you're using right now. Um, we have control over the comments we make, we have control over ratings and favouritings and playlists, we have controls of those kind of things, now a channel page, and the extent to which we use that is the extent to which we're taking responsibility for our part of the undergrowth, and when we don't take responsibility for that, and then, we're, then we have no right to complain about YouTube not taking responsibility for its more global management structures, and quite frankly, uh, uh, Thunderfoot, you're not managing your part of the undergrowth. You know, you're, you're rambling on about YouTube uh, being uh, as being stagnant, but the little bit of the puddle that you're controlling or is not um, is not. You haven't got the chlorine out. You haven't got the chlorine out. Nor have you put um, good growth in. I suppose what I'm looking at here right now. I've got your page open in front of me here, Thunderfoot. This particular video, Stagnation of YouTube. And I'm looking at your video responses. You have 19 video responses. Some of them are about the New World Order and Starbucks. Uh, two videos about rabbits, chinchillas. Um, one or two about uh, the actual video itself. Actually, there's three about chinchillas. One about Coughlin. Just different things. Something to do with... What's that one? I can't even read that one. Um... Just a whole, the one about the Quran, a whole range of things which have nothing to do with your video. Now the fact that you're allowing these responses means that you're not taking responsibility for the effective horticulture of your little part of the forest. All right. It means that this is just it, you're increasing the noise to signal ratio of this little bit of the of YouTube, because this is the part of the medium. You understand that, right? That the connections that we make are. Uh, the medium that we're in control of. And when you neglect that, you're just letting weeds grow all over your forest floor and it's choking out effective stuff. Um, I mean, I could give other instances of how you're not taking responsibility for yourself either, uh, which would be fine. You know, if you, fine, if you want to just you run your channel your way, but don't run your channel in this really, what I think is a really sloppy way, and then complain about YouTube not doing its job properly. I mean, seriously.